mystery continues to shroud the circumstances surrounding the death of mongrel mob member Raniel Q, in Palmerston North. Despite police efforts, no arrests have been made thus far. The tragedy unfolded on the evening of Thursday, May 18, 2023, when Q, aged 35, sustained severe injuries at a residence on Dulia Street in the heart of Palmerston North. Raniel Q, also known as Q Dog, was a member of Mongrel Mob Aotearoa chapter. Emergency services rushed to the scene, as multiple police cars and ambulances filled the area. CPR was administered to Q on the street, but unfortunately, he did not survive. He was later pronounced dead at the hospital. In response to this incident, authorities launched a homicide inquiry on Friday. The Dulia Street property, located within sight of the rear of the Palmerston North Police Station, became the focus of investigations. Detective Inspector Craig Sheridan released a statement on Friday morning, revealing that police had been called after receiving a report of a man sustaining serious injuries. The man in question, Raniel Q, was quickly transported to the hospital, but could not be saved. Throughout the day, a section near 8 Dulia Street remained cordoned off while investigators continued their work. On Friday evening, police officers, including some with forensic boiler suit, were still present at the scene. A blue police tent had been erected over a particular area on the roadside, and blood stains were visible on the street. Police mentioned that preliminary information indicated that the individuals involved in the incident were acquainted with one another and there was no immediate threat to public safety. Post-mortem examination were conducted, and Q's body was returned to his family and the investigation into his death remains ongoing, with police actively seeking to interview several individuals. On Friday morning, a group of mongrel mob members congregated at the scene, while a larger gathering, including individuals adorned in mongrel mob colors, assembled on Saturday afternoon. Since Q's passing, the city has witnessed an increased presence of mongrel mob members, particularly on May 18, when his funeral took place. The funeral procession traversed Palmerston North before making a stop at Kelvin Grove Cemetery. The mourners gathered at Moheke Avenue and then moved to Kelvin Grove Crematorium. Authorities have not disclosed specific details about how Q sustained his injuries. Although there have been no significant incidents thus far, the police remain prepared to respond to any potential issues that may arise due to the heightened gang activity in the area following Q's demise. Police confirmed that they have completed the scene examination at Adulia Street property after spending four days at the scene. The investigation team is working to piece together what has taken place in the incident in which Q died. Inquiries are ongoing, including forensic examinations.